Welcome to Guilt Free Cooking. Today we are making healthy naan that are delicious, yeast free, do not require an oven, and they're vegan. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's get into the recipe. To make these naan, we will use one cup of wheat flour, one cup of quinoa flour. If you don't have quinoa flour, feel free to use all wheat flour. One teaspoon of coconut sugar or brown sugar. We're going to put one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of salt, three fourth teaspoon baking soda, and give it a little mix. And then we make a little well in the middle. And then we are going to be adding one tablespoon of plant-based yogurt, but you can use normal yogurt if you're not vegan, and one tablespoon of oil, and give it a mix again. And then we are going to be adding warm water into this to make it into a dough. Pour in our warm water. I've used quinoa flour in this recipe because it's high in protein, iron, and antioxidant. Now, we are going to just give it a little bit more of a mix and then add in the water till the time we can get into a dough. We are going to go in with our hands and make a nice dough. Our dough is now ready. We're going to cover it and leave it for an hour. An hour has gone by. This guy is ready. Let's start rolling them out. I'm going to start with a very old pan that I have that I don't use at all now. I'm going to flip it over and turn on the fire to medium high and let the pan get warm. Let's start by dusting the surface with some flour. We'll take our dough and divide it into three equal portions. We'll be making three naans today. We're going to sprinkle some flour on the top as well. Flatten it down and roll it into a flat bread. Now the naan is nicely rolled up. It should be around this thick. Now I'm going to generously apply water on the top and then I'm going to take it to the pan and flip the wet side onto the pan. We keep it there till the time the bread starts to rise and then we're going to flip it over and do the top side the same way. This is going to cook the top side of the bread as well and it's going to give a nice brown effect. Let me flip over and show you once. You see how it started to brown already? Now our naan is ready. We're going to remove it. And we are going to apply some vegan butter on top. This is optional, but highly recommended. My nans are ready and I'm excited to have a taste. I'm gonna use the curry that I have from last night and taste it along with that. Mmm. This tastes just like restaurant style. So next week I'll be showing you a dish to pair with these naans. So don't forget to tune in and don't forget to subscribe. Bye, see you.